This is Delta Launch Control at T minus 64 minutes and counting. And I'm privileged to have with me now Steve Volt, who is the uh, CloudSat Calypso uh, program executive from uh, NASA headquarters. Steve, thanks for joining us. This morning. Thanks for having me. It's a great time to be here, that's for sure. Yes, it is. And we hope to have a good launch today to show everybody. But uh, uh, tell us a little bit about the uh, international partnership that we have uh, developed on uh, in processing this mission. Well, this mission actually is two missions, the CloudSat and Calypso missions, and each of them has a, a unique contribution and a necessary contribution for from uh, international partners. The uh, Calypso mission uh, is a second of, a, of some that we've had with the, Cana the French space agency, CNES. Um, they contributed not only the spacecraft um, and one of the three instruments, but also all of the uh, spacecraft operations during the three-year lifetime of the mission. So we're actually tied in with the Toulouse Space Center in uh, France right now on voice line, and they're going to be doing the, the spacecraft operations from the, the get-go here. Great. And on the um, CloudSat side, the Canadian space agency, CSA, contributed a a key element of the uh, cloud profiling radar, really the uh, necessary element component to make this thing, to make the CloudSat instrument work. So both of these have been necessary and very, very critical contributions to the two missions. Okay, and I assume that uh, because of this uh, partnership that we've established that uh, there's some uh, follow-up relationships that we're going to be having with them in the future? That's true. Um, the, uh, we already have in the works a, a second, another collaboration with CNES, the uh, JSON-2, as they call it, or the OSTM, Ocean Surface Topology Mission. Mm -hmm. Top topography mission that we have working in the, in, the, in the works for a launch in 2008. And this is actually the second. We had Jason, which was another one with Kness. This is one of a series of several missions we've had with mm -hmm. Kness where we share um, common interest, obviously, in, in doing this earth science research and, and contributing. We get much better results out of our satellites. And the information, the data that we're getting back from uh, from both of these flights, we're going to be uh, sharing it uh, with uh, with those that are involved. These are these are exploratory missions, um, part of the Earth System Science Pathfinder program out of NASA's Earth Science program. Um, so, uh, one of the benefits of that is, you know, we're not quite sure all the great things we're going to get out of it, but uh, we already have in the pipeline CloudSat from particular for. Um, near real-time direct it, transfer of the data to some possible operational users. The Air Force is certainly interested in the data that we get from CloudSat. With, uh, we're going to be delivering it with a three to five hour latency. Um, and unusual for an exploratory mission like CloudSat. Calypso is a little bit longer time between when we take the data to when we distribute it, but um, there, we've got a, a nice framework set up for, the, for sharing it with the community and to get the data distributed as much as possible so we get the, the greatest use from all the potential users out there. Okay. And, of course, uh, these missions have been in the planning stages for quite some time, so I'm sure everybody's uh, uh, eager to see, uh, see it get on orbit. Eager is not quite the word. <laughs> Frantic, almost. Um, yes, these have been... These were a response to a 1998 announcement of opportunity. These are peer-selected missions that were um, competitive selected, I should have said, from the community of amongst a, a wide range of, of very good proposals. And um, the, uh, the science community is ready, willing, and eager to use the data as soon as we can get it to them. Great. Well, we're just uh, about 61 minutes away from launch, so I know there's still a lot of work to be done, and, uh, and uh, we've got a lot of coordination even still yet to be done over this next uh, hour and a half before, before we launch. So uh, good luck to, uh, to you and the rest of the team, and uh, we'll, we'll see a good launch this morning. Okay. Yeah. We certainly expect to. All right. Thank sir. you, Bruce. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, again, we are at uh, T-minus 60 minutes and counting, uh, about uh, 90 minutes away from launch. At T-minus 60 minutes and counting, this is Delta Launch Control.